What is up, guys? So today I did a best of five, not a best of three, a best of five, uh, with Monkey Lord. Uh, he has a pretty awesome channel. He does gameplay with music, and he does do commentary sometimes. Um, so yeah, definitely check him out. He actually uses the same editing software as me, uh, but he's, the, the difference is he's actually good with it. Um, but yeah, so last video, I, uh, I asked you guys at the beginning of the video to join my Discord server, and we got about 20 people joining just from that, which was uh, really, really good, actually. So now we're on like 180 people, uh, and I really want to get to 200 soon. Uh, so if you're interested in joining my server, then please do. We have like ranks and lots of stuff, and it's, it's quite fun. Uh, and I'm, I'm normally active like maybe an hour a day, uh, <laughs> possibly a bit less than that. But yeah, I, I'm active on it quite a lot, so you can talk to me there. And yeah, it's just kind of a fun thing to do. So, in this best of five, of course, uh, we started on offside. Like, literally, I think every, like all um, best of threes, best of fives, the starting map is uh, on offside. Like, um, if, you, if you think about it, like Curly's tournament uh, starts on offside. Uh, lots of other tournaments did. So, um, the only problem is with this, because I'm doing a commentary um, like this, because I, Battles TV did not work. So, I, I was going to record Battles TV, because I could slow it down and speed it up whenever I wanted to, and I could do a good commentary. Uh, but the really, really annoying thing was, uh, the Battles TV, for some reason, uh, did not work. Like, it didn't record our games whatsoever. So, that really sucks, because when I did my best of three... Uh, with Bolt Tricks, uh, I, I could do it on Battles TV and it was really fun. Um, so that's kind of been a reason why I've been um, why I've been kind of pos uh, postponing this video because the commentary I try to make it good, but it is hard because of course we don't have Battles TV. So I split it up to four times um, just so I don't have to talk for ages and bore, <laughs> bore you guys. Uh, but yeah, let's get into the gameplay. So in the last game, I got a Ring of Fire up, thinking that it would defend uh, the regens. But no, it, it leaked. I probably should have just got a Maelstrom, to be honest. Um, but yeah, that that was definitely... <laughs> I, I definitely thought that would defend, but nope, apparently not. So I'm never going to go for the Tax Shooter again. So of course I chose uh, this map. Yin Yang is literally, I think it's my favourite map right now. Um, in the Curly Tournament, which is coming up, I am definitely going to be picking this map um, if I lose. <laughs> so this strat's pretty good at it. It's only kind of weakness in a way is fast cooldown moabs. It is poor, very poor, against fast uh, fast cooldown moabs. Um, which you may see in this game. I can't remember. It's been so long. Um, but yeah, only... So the, the offside game did record on Battles TV. Um, that was the only one that recorded, but I thought it wouldn't be worth it just to do one on Battles TV. Also, when I'm doing it on Battles TV, um, you literally you can't overlay... Uh, images. You can't overlay images on um, this editing uh, software, so I couldn't get rid of the timer of, you know, saying how long the games were, uh, which Curly pointed out, I think, and that really sucks, I know. So yeah, Monkey Lord actually boosted there, uh, so now he's used up two of his boosts, two out of three, and of course it's not Battles TV, so um, <laughs> we can't see how many boosts he has left for sure. But yeah, the, the definite, if uh, Monkey Lord rushed me with fast cooldown mobs right now, I would definitely find it hard. But this is where uh, I go for a, for a decent sized rush, right? So I go for tons um, of BFBs, and he didn't get the he didn't get the ground zero up, and it did overwhelm his defense. The the Super Monkey Fan Club is not enough for that amount of balloons, uh, even with a boost, because it it will run out when the uh, the BFBs get onto the other side of the map. Uh, that's why Yin Yang is pretty good bad for regrows, because it just goes around the corner and just regrows tons and doesn't stop. So yeah, Bridge and Rainbow Rush is on that map are pretty good. Um, right, so Monkey Lord chose a game. Um, for the third game, and I hate this map. I am awful on <laughs> I am awful on this map. Uh, sometimes I go with the Cobra strategy. Uh, I think yeah, Cobra bomb mortar, uh, but it's <clears throat> it's awful against the AI. It really is. So I ended up going Dark Farm Ace. Um, perhaps I should have gone bomb, um, but I, I I like going with the Ace. So yeah, bear in mind if Monkey Lord does like do the thumbs down or something like that. It's not because he's BMing, it's because I did something wrong. And you can always see he does the thumbs up after he does that, just to make yeah, just to make sure that I know that. So, 
Round 13, no one went for a rush, surprisingly. I guess because we wanted to carry on farming. And you can see he's uh, ahead on farms right now. Plus, we have the same defense. So I end up rushing him with some regen leads. Do get a boost out of him, which is nice. Uh, and then he gets a boost out of... I don't boost. Okay, I just leak tons of lives to that. And uh, yeah, I got an ninja force. Four towers are allowed. Uh, so that was pretty sweet. I send a Moab, which he then boosts. Uh, so now he only has one boost left, which is nice. And I still have my three boosts, which I use one up now. Uh, and you can see I'm pretty low on lives. So I had to kind of do that. And he sends another Moab at me. And I end up dying to the AI. Um... <laughs> I, I, I don't know why, I should have got another Bloon Jitsu at the bottom. Or maybe even two, to be honest. I should have sold more farms, to be honest. So yeah, I choose um, I choose Hydro Dam. I, I quite like Hydro Dam, and the boat is pretty good on it as well. Um, lots of people go for the sub, and I'm not sure if the sub's really that viable on this map, to be honest. I think Boat and Wizard is so much better in every way. Uh, because if you're going with the sub, then uh, Reactor is awful on this map. Airburst starts is decent. But you can't start off well, um, you know, you have to save up money for the ever starts. Whereas, going for a boat, a simple boat can defend pretty well. Uh, and then when you get Grape Shot as well, it, it can deal with stuff easily. Like, for boosted yellows, you'll have to boost with two ever starts. With boats, you can just get, like, a Destroyer up and boost. Or if you get another, uh, if you get a Wizard up to Lightning Bolt, then you'll be fine. So... Uh, Monkey Lord actually goes with the Boomerang and Boat, where, whereas I am going with the Monkey Apprentice and Boat. Uh, and you can see uh, that we're pretty equal on farms right now. He goes to some Regen Zebras. Uh, I didn't need to boost it at all, because the Destroyer is really good, actually. Um, I think I played this game pretty well. I'm not going to tell you what happens. Um, but I do play this game really well with the Boat. I defend quite a few rushes. Um, but yeah, I almost kill him with those uh, Rainbows right there. That was close. And we get him to sell a farm, which is nice. Uh, but you can see we defended that rush without even having to boost. So we still, we still have three energies left, which is unbelievable. Uh, well, not unbelievable, but it's pretty good. So I'm just continuously rushing him, uh, and I kill him with the fast cooldown ceramics of the Moab. Uh, because the Boomer ability can only do t uh, so much. He would have been better off getting like five destroyers. But then again, that costs a lot. Uh, five destroyers would cost... What's it? 3,000 uh, for each one, so that's 15,000, which is uh, above what we both had at that moment. Right, so he chooses Wattle Resorts for the last one. Bear in mind, this is a, this is a best of five, and it's gone to five games. So th this best of five it, it had taken quite a long time, uh, because I put this on full-time speed. Uh, you probably know that. Also, tomorrow I've got a really good Dread Balloon uh, Cave video. And then we got a BFB Coliseum video after that that I pre-recorded. Uh, BFB is from like a week, <laughs> a week ago. I still haven't posted it. Uh, but I've done the commentary and everything, so that's almost finished. Uh, and then the Dreadloon one is where I randomised. And I got Super Monkey, Monkey Village, <laughs> and Banana Farm. Which is absolutely hilarious. Right, so I'm uh, just pressuring him with a few blacks. He does exactly the same thing to me. Uh, Monkey Lord Monkey Lord is a pretty good player. He hasn't played for a while, uh, so he's a tiny bit rusty. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm actually up in farms in this game uh, by quite a bit. You can see that. And uh, He boosts some whites and like leads at me, and well, you, you, you saw what happened. The leads kind of regen at the bottom. Not a great map for regens, to be honest. Uh, I go for a, quite a lot of zebras, but it really does not do anything. It doesn't force him to get much up at all. So yeah, bear in mind, this is the last game. So if I lose this, then I have lost. So you send some regen leads. All fine against that. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Um, it's almost finished. And uh, yeah, I really hope you enjoyed. I, I'm going to carry on this series of playing YouTubers. And yeah, see you in the next video. Well, actually, we defended that. But you, <laughs> you'll see here that I can't defend the mob. And I die. So yeah, see ya.